For Dale, cold weather has triggered joint pain that just keeps getting worse. My legs, my feet, my arms, everything hurt. Oh. Treatments for arthritis and an old back injury didn't do any good. So doctors ran extensive blood tests to find another diagnosis and uncovered a new, seemingly unrelated illness. I'm sorry to say that you've got leukemia, chronic lymphocytic leukemia to be exact. Chronic lymphocytic leukemia is a slow-moving cancer that affects particular types of white blood cells called lymphocytes, which help the body fight infection. Dale begins chemotherapy to treat his leukemia. But despite heavy doses of morphine, his mysterious pain only gets more unbearable. I was doing a lot of morphine at the time. The uh, pain would come in like a wave, just overtake me. And then it gets worse. Caroline! My fingers start changing. The tips of his fingers turn purple. You better check your toes. <gasps> My toes started turning slightly purple. Dale is admitted and begins receiving an IV vasodilator to increase blood flow to his extremities. But the drugs do nothing to alleviate the pain in his feet. A vascular surgeon is brought in to assess Dale's condition. The discoloration is spreading up his leg. You could almost sit there and watch it change. It was so fast. It went from normal color to black chard. Unable to diagnose his condition, his doctor has given him an agonizing choice to save his life. I'm afraid your toes are beyond saving. We're going to have to amputate them. I was still in pain, a lot of pain, and it didn't matter to me what they did. Fine. How can you say that amputation is the best treatment option when you don't even know what's wrong with him? I'm sorry. We're not going to consent to this. I just didn't understand it. There's no reason for him to have those taken off. Unless they knew what it was. Please. Carolyn makes a frantic attempt to move Dale to a major hospital nearby that has a reputation for diagnosing rare diseases. Dale is transferred by ambulance and admitted to the second hospital for further testing. His case is assigned to a hematologist who specializes in rare blood disorders. He quickly offers a new diagnosis. It's a type of vasculitis, but there are many kinds, including a very rare one linked to leukemia. We're going to need some more tests. Vasculitis causes the walls of blood vessels to thicken or scar, restricting blood flow. This can then cause organ and tissue damage. The doctor offers his diagnosis. Dale has type 1 cryoglobulinemia. Cryoglobulinemia is the presence of abnormal proteins in the blood. These proteins thicken in cold temperatures. Type 1 is most often related to a blood cancer like leukemia. Is there a cure? Of sorts. Anti-inflammatory drugs and plasma filtering could rid Dale's blood of the abnormal protein. With cryoglobulinemia, sometimes we have to remove the plasma from the blood so as to remove these abnormal proteins before they do more damage. It was amazing to know that it was something that they could stop in its tracks. Doctors are unable to save Dale's necrotic toes, but they are able to halt the damage done to his other tissue. Four toes were taken off and um, the pain went away. I was told to stay home, but I, I eventually I had to get back to work because I just couldn't just sit around the house all day long. Every day I was feeling better. I mean, continuing to feel better every day. Where are you going? Garage. A miracle, oh my God. You know, you just, <laughs> it was just, it was wonderful. It was the best news ever.